you know, we have a new set, we have Carnival kind of Cloud, this, you know, they've been playing for a decent bit, I feel like every time Kai is winning slash like even, and then like 30 seconds late, 30 seconds later he loses by like two stocks. <laughs> There's definitely at least a lot of games, both like offline and online, that. I mean, you know, sometimes we should be like that. Sometimes she's at 130 and you just barely struggle, you barely fail to close out that stock, and then you just lose the next stock just trying to overcommit and land like one bay on her. I guess of the two, who would I rather? I mean, I've played Kai in ages, so it'd be cool to like play in winners, uh, winners finals. I feel like 90 90 percent of my like SA sets over the past six months have been against like my SA like winners finals slash grand final sets have been like against McLeod, and then the other ten being now um, you know Davin or. Um, uh, Nick, I haven't played Kai in a set in a while, so it'd be cool to play one. Uh, what, what venue is this? This is the same venue as before, we're just in a different uh, area today because normally we're on the stage, but because. So normally our Cheese League is next week because Phantom's happening um, next week, we we're sharing with Ultimate. And since they have the stage, uh, we have this like section of the room. Alright, going in, in game. Perfect. Just, it's it's so hard just hitting her without getting down smashed. There's just so many little things now that just aren't. There's so many things that we all thought was like true or like we kind of knew wasn't true, but like nobody ever actually did the counterplay. So, like I mean, every time you jab someone, you know that it's like fake as hell. But like you still go for it. But cards out there now. Just. SDI down, uh, down smashing it. it. Sucks. We were losing. We're slowly losing more and more of our toys. Spot here. Let's. Okay. How's he gonna? Yeah. It's like ideally you want to. Um, you want to corral Peach into grabbing ledge and not just let her get back to stage three. But when she has the float up, like at that height, it's just so tricky. There's so many like different timing mix ups she can do coming down a bit. You just kind of have to like give up a little bit of stage and perspective. And then this spot right here, this is like the fusing a bomb. You just, there's so many, there's so many little things that the Falco. If like the Falco does not properly, he's just gonna get down smashed. Very nice CC. It's so scary to CC against Peach at times, but like, there's still a lot of stuff that she does that, like, you can. I, was, I wonder if that Nair was actually intentional. He didn't, like, sort of drift forwards, he just put a Nair in place. And, like, it's very hard to get reversal out of that Nair. Like, it's very hard to, like... I mean, Peach is also at 160, so he doesn't have to really worry about uh, any sort of CC. Kind of gets slapped off stage. I feel like he's looking for a bear or a down tilt here, like some laser down tilt. Ooh, goes for laser jab. I guess this percent jab probably can't be ACI down. Is that gonna close? That does. It's gonna close out the stock. Jesus. Asked um, whether I think the loser's quarters, but they could just play off stream or not. And I was like, you know what? Ask McLeod later. We have this game right here, and right now, God, they're both so close. That's 
sketchy. Oh, that was a sketchy shine still, but doesn't matter. Gets the bear, closes out the. How much? Oh, gets absolutely no extra percent. And now we're back to. Now we're back to just the Falco. Desperately avoiding down smash. Ooh, yeah. See, like, he lands a dare, but, like, it's just. It's unsafe. <laughs> it's. It. Yeah, at least at Fox you can just land like a point blank drill and just get. If, if assuming it's not SCI, then you just get like a shine. Falco's. I'm not really sure what Falco's supposed to do in that spot. <laughs> Each time a cloud doesn't hit his eye float, his eyebrow comes out. The center, that's great, I didn't notice that at all. That's cool though, he's like. Getting more and more comfortable for these, like, very consciously aware when it's like. And he's like unsatisfied, but it's, it's not just like a. Like, he's expecting the hype to float. Or like the sub or whatever. Aw, oh, yeah. That's what I was talking about before, about. We used to have that jab. That jab used to be like. We used to get away with it. But still, some really nice percent. But like at this point, Beach just landing a bear on there. <laughs> it's probably just kind of close out the stock immediately. What's that gonna do? No, not quite. And <laughs> not quite even. So many very close stocks are just haven't quite. Well, that one definitely. That one definitely. That was that was a unsafe there, but Cloud not ready to appropriately punish it. Then again, I guess maybe he wasn't act. No, he could have ACI down. There. Even like he was, even if he was in turn of lag, he still would um... Very, very nice, super, really nice shield pressure, and like the fade away there as well. Just like the early nair, but then fading it away so that like. Can't get shield grabbed. And this is a really nice little tidy loop for Kai so far. Some good crouch cancel. Also, I do appreciate. I went like when I um. It's unfair, but when like a non-peach Samus is like appropriately using CC, I'm just like, good for you, damn it. When peach and Samus is like, you almost feel like it's ingrained in their game plan. But when like a fox is just like actually using CC properly, or like a Falco, you're just like, damn, good for you. <laughs> True, also really just kind of holding down for Shine a lot of times, like... <laughs> when, when you go from there, Shine, and you're holding down anyway, and you get CC, and... Just like, yeah. Maybe it's just the spacey bias in me. Just rolls up. 
Yes, every set um, is best of five at this point. I think we set in general this tournament because it was like only nine people was uh, best of five. But... See, we see. I mean, we see that like a lot of times Kai will land at like jab spacing after a laser then toss out a jab and it just doesn't really work. It feels like against McLeod it's just like he's getting very little and sometimes he's not getting directly punished like something like a down smash immediately but it's putting him in an awkward position and he's not really ever getting anything out of these jabs. like string monstering and like <laughs> talking about the game god okay. gets you know gets the laser jab this time and this is this is looking a very commanding position to fight and that's it that's game goal high up 2-1 that's But don't get me wrong, it's not like this would be a, like, oh my god, major upset, but it, it would be a little, a little bit of an upset. I feel like the, I feel like both of them go, like, they definitely have a lot of, um, 3-1, 3-2 set wins, but I feel like McLeod pretty much always wins them. I'm sure would be very happy getting this, but he's no, definitely not out of it yet, he still has to, so let's take at least one more game and, Last game, McLeod really didn't get much off grabs. I mean, it's hard because it's actually was like hard finding these grabs, but like, I'm right. it's hard. It's I guess it's it's really tricky when like Falco is just doing this like safe-ish, you know, non-committal. At least not very committal, like pressure. It's like actually like obviously 50 is very good for Peach because of the chain grab, but like actually getting a chain, like landing a grab on spaces is just like it's rough. Very nice mix up on the drift. <sighs> that was really nice. All of that Kai's defense so far has been very very. Good. That was, a, that was a greedy ledge chest jab, but I mean, if they're not expecting like the immediate up B or site, like if they're not expecting the immediate ledge dash, then you know, jab might be able to catch them out. So shocked that Dare actually connected. I assumed McLeod would be just outside his, uh, outside the spacing, but he's kind of getting bought this game. <laughs> this is a it is FD, but still, it's all right. We have a fresh new Falco stock. Let's see what he does with it. Tosses out a few jabs. You know, he's invincible, so it's not like he's gonna get... He's not gonna get immediately down smash, but still. He's, 
at this point, he's at like, yeah, I was about to say, like, at laser down tilt percent. And honestly, about 20 or 30 more, and just any, ba any back air will just close it out. Of course, if I get the spot, it can be, like, very tempting just to go into, like, we kind of like that, just kind of, like, kill move mode. It's like, I will only do back airs. Doesn't really matter what the situation is, I will only do back air. The rest of the stock will be finished and closed out with back air. Ooh, that was bad DI. Not quite. The laser up smash. Is this on Smash GG currently? Uh, yes, it should be. I feel like there is a, um, like if you type exclamation mark bracket, there sh it should link to the... Oh yeah, there, there we go. Well, <laughs> like helping out, that's... Oh yeah, true stuff.